GIMP 2.4 comes with a new filter that helps us compensate for numerous problems that are linked to using um, imperfect, cheaper lenses. As you can see on this image, there's quite severe vignetting on all four corners of the image. Uh, there's also some barrel distortion um, that isn't visible on this particular image because you don't have any straight lines in here, but it's there. You can just, you know, sort of make it out on the, on the edges of the image. Uh, I'm just going to compensate for this, uh, you know, just uh, trying my luck, uh, not being very precise. Um, the the vignetting is not on this uh, image is not uh, just a property of the of the lens. You can see uh, that uh, it's most probably a filter that was attached on the lens, so it shows up quite strongly on the sides. It's almost black on the sides. So let's try to get rid of this nasty effect. Um, the, f the filter is can be found in, in the filters menu under distorts lens distortion. It comes up with, oh, I'm just going to reset, it comes up with a, a nice preview that also has a new new functionality <laughs> which is being able to zoom in while having a full, um, like a big picture view of the whole image. In this particular case, it's very useful because for barrel distortion compensation, we, we want to have a view like this, where we see the whole image and we can align, uh, you know, fix the, 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 the curvature. While for vignetting, we want to be able to, to zoom in to a particular idea and see if it has been fixed by tweaking these parameters or not. Um, so let's get to it. Uh, there's two parameters for, for balance distortion. Um, the, the main slider works on the whole image. You can see that it affected pretty much everywhere, although the sides have been affected more than, or the, the edges, corners, uh, than, than the central area, while edge really only works on, on the edges. It's going to be useful when you have some sort of uh, a straight line somewhere in the image, so you can tweak it so that it looks straight, um, even if it runs like everywhere in the central area and the edges. Um, then you have uh, the problem with with the vignetting. Um, there's a Brighton slider that helps us fix that. It it, it doesn't apply uniformly. Um, it only applies on the edges or the corners of the image. So the more you uh, brighten the corners, the uh, the more uniform the lighting of the whole shot is, which is exactly what we want to do. But in some cases, you want to add vignetting. You do want to 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 bring attention to an object that's somewhere in the central area. Um, if you have it like offset, you most probably do. It's not in the center. Uh, there's the shift parameters for that. But you know, I can see this is vignetting edit. Um, but we're gonna compensate for it, so let's try this. Just check that. Uh, it's still a bit showing. But okay, there's still a bit of vignetting in there, but uh, just for the demo.